Good morning everyone. In today's video we're gonna see if uh, we can get regen braking working on my e-bike. Uh, basically what regen braking is, it's every time I'm gonna apply the brake it's uh, gonna use the motor to slow the bike down and also recover the energy spent back into the battery to kind of recharge it a little bit every time you slow down or go downhill every time you use your brakes. For those that are new to the channel uh, this is a thousand watt rear hub motor that I got off eBay and uh, this is 15S 4P battery uh, that I built myself. If you're interested uh, how I put this bike together you can uh, go back on a playlist and take a look at all those videos but in today's video we're gonna figure out the regen. Let's get started. <laughs> guys this is the controller I took it off the bike so this is all the markings that it has on there uh, I don't know if this really means anything for this Chinese little uh, motor controllers but uh, this is what mine says on the outside I'm gonna take it apart and then we're gonna take a look inside and see what we can see as far as enabling that regenerative braking let's get going So this is what my controller looks like on the inside. It's a 12 MOSFETs right there. A 63 volt cap. So uh, me running my battery at 61 volts is not shouldn't hurt it, hopefully. And uh, me flipping it around right here. That's what it looks like from the back. So after doing a little bit of research, uh, it looks like in order for me to enable regenerative braking on this controller. I don't know if it's possible or not, but we're gonna definitely try. And uh, we're gonna connect this X and DS, these two pins right there. We're gonna connect them together. I'm gonna solder a little bit of a bit of solder right in between the two and connect them together and see if we can get the regenerative brake and work in that way. Uh, so I'm gonna solder those together, put it to whole control back together, put it back in the bike, and we'll go to some test runs, see if uh, we got it working or not. Alrighty guys, we are at the trail and I'm gonna give you a quick spoiler. Regen is working and it's freaking awesome. So uh, this is the screen that we're gonna see when I'm gonna start riding. Uh, as I'm gonna take off, you're gonna see this number in negative and when I hit the brake, you'll see that num number go up in positives, meaning regen is putting power back into the battery. One thing I've found out about this uh, regen is that if my battery voltage is above 58.5 volts, regen quits working so uh, since i have run 15s pack uh, 58.5 volts is uh, 3.9 volts per cell anything above that regen is not works whenever that deplete my batteries to 3.9 per cell 58.5 total then regen starts working and works all the way down so which is pretty pretty good for me because uh, it's going to prolong the life of the cells it's not going to try to regen and recharge them when the cells are still charged up all the way and high and uh, as soon as it gets down to 3.9 it starts charging them but anyways uh, let's take it for a quick ride so you can see how, how it is
All right, so the next test I'm gonna do is gonna be the range test. So the last time we got 19.5 miles to the charge without pedaling at all. I'm gonna kind of repeat that test, but now with regen and see how many miles we're gonna gain by having the regen. I'm assuming it's gonna be a couple miles or something because our trail has a lot of stop and go because we come to the road, we stop and then we keep going. So there's a lot of stop and go. So it's gonna be, regen is gonna be pretty beneficial for me. So I'm gonna redo that test and uh, I'll get back to you with the results. Alrighty guys, there, here's the result for the range test, 23.14 of a mile. So 23 miles uh, compared to 19 and a half miles that I've gotten before without regen. So we had about a three mile increase. I mean, there could be an error here because I only did one test for before the regen and only one test with regen. There, those are the results. It, it is an improvement, definite an improvement. And another benefit of the regen is uh, the way it slows you down. Because once you hit the brake, it really helps you to slow down and uh, save on your brakes also. So I hope you guys liked the video. Uh, make sure you hit the like button if you did like it. Dislike it if you disliked it. And uh, make sure you subscribe because we got lots more videos coming up. Lots of cool projects that I have going on I want to share with you guys. And uh, I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.